What's poppin', what's poppin'? What's poppin', what's poppin'? See, this is my advice on proposing and marriage. I'm I'm gonna be real with you, you know? And this is not about every uh, couple that's married because it's actually some couples who's married and they're happy, you know? But for the most part, I'm talking about the most part. Let me tell you how marriage is, man. As time goes on, you two get tired of each other. And then that's when other things start coming in to fulfill the emptiness because most guys gonna get married before they know themselves. They gonna get married before they experience life. They gonna get married before they find their purpose in life. So imagine this, you married and you have to um, tend to her emotions, you know, make her happy, but you don't know yourself as a man. You haven't found your purpose in life yet, but yet you still have to make sure the house is good. If you got kids, the kids is good, you know. And I'm not, and I'm not talking about the, the guys with kids, you know. Hey, if you made a kid, hey, if everything's going good with that woman, stay with that woman, you know. That's the best way it should be because you don't want to be like, like me included. You don't want to be not in the same household as your kid. You don't want to go through that. That's not the life. So if you got a kid with that woman and y'all can make things work, hey, make that shit work, you know? But I'm talking to the guys who aren't married yet. You don't have kids. You don't want to go through that life. I'm telling you, as time goes on, it gets old. And guess what? Women, they start exploring. They so used to you, now they want they want fun, they want adventure. And guess who will give it to them? It used to be me. I used to be that guy who comes in, give them adventure, all that shit. I'm telling you, and it's so easy. Like I say, man, married women are the easiest. I'm just saying, you know, they, they are the easiest because they're so used to their husband. So you don't want to put yourself in this position to where you don't know your purpose and you got married, you know, you got married and you can't really lead a family if you don't know yourself. If you don't know yourself, you can't lead nobody else. If you don't love yourself, you can't lead nobody else. If you haven't went through shit, you can't love nobody else. You're gonna be out here cheating on the low. You go, I'm telling you, guess who was that nigga? I was that nigga. I was cheating, didn't get caught. Like I was just doing it because I can do it. And I, and I was always a loner, so I did shit by myself. I did shit by myself. You know, didn't tell nobody. You know? And that's what happens when you can't be real to yourself. You know, I couldn't be real to myself. In my 20s, I'm telling you, man, nigga, I started, I was lying. And to me, a lie was the truth. Cause nigga, I wasn't, <laughs> I wasn't telling on myself. That's one thing I never told on myself, <laughs> you know? So I know you be seeing all these long posts of people saying, I'm so happy here. Trust me, man, it's all fake. It's fake. Like I said, you got some real ones, but most of it is fake. A lot of people are miserable. A lot of people want to leave, but they can't. You know, and you don't want to put yourself in that in that kind of position. Like I say, the girls you deal with, when you get where you want to be at in life for yourself, the girls you want to deal with, you want them to be crazy about you. You know, you want them to miss you. You want to have... Like I say, bro, you want to have options. You want them to miss you. In this day and age, marriage, marriage is fake. It's, it's for social media. It's for, you know, it's all fake. Like I say, the easiest woman to get with is married women. You know, it's the easiest. And let me tell you something. A lot of guys who, a lot of guys who get married, and they lose everything. They keep it real with you. It's guys losing everything because they got married. And nine times out of ten, you not go marry the right person. 
I'm just gonna keep it real. You, you not go marry the person that you really care about. It's always somebody. A woman go always marry a man who, uh, like, is safe, who provides. You know, she's never gonna marry the guy that she really, really loves, that really know how to break her back, that really drives her crazy. That rarely happens. It happens, but it rarely happens, you know? And as time goes on, I promise you, you know? Let me tell you my story, man. I proposed and like three weeks later, this chick told me she didn't like the ring. So she stopped wearing the ring. And that's when I learned the game. Look, when a woman loves you, she don't need a ring. All you gotta say is, will you marry me? She will start crying. She don't need a ring, you know? That's love. But I'm telling you, most guys, most us, we never are with. <laughs> The girl that really cared about us, like we just, we either played them, we did, you know. But it's cool. You can always get better as a man. And living in your past, I'm telling you, living in the past, it will mess you up. You know, in life, you have to forgive yourself and you have to move on. Because these women gonna move on. They gonna move on to a new guy. They gonna marry a new guy. They gonna marry a new guy with your kid. They gonna want your kid to call them dad. I'm telling you, after you done paid for the house, after you done did this, oh, she gonna marry another dude and she gonna want your kid to call him dad or her dad. I'm being real. Is that the life that you want? You know? You don't want, you don't wanna be out here getting married if you don't, don't don't go that route, man. These are not the times. Like I say, if you go first, cool. Cool. You know? But uh, like I said, if a woman already had a lot of breakups, a lot of heartbreaks, if she had responsibility like kids, she, like she already has uh, kids for another guy and stuff like that, I'm telling you, it's going to be hard. I'm not saying it's impossible, but it's gonna put so much stress on you, you won't even have a life, dog. You know, yeah, a lot of guys go, you know, they go say it on social media that, oh, I got the best, trust me. When they look in that mirror at night, they know they deserve better. They know it. The person you should wanna marry is you wanna marry yourself. You wanna. Be, like I always say, you want to fall in love with your life first. Marriage, yeah, if you get married, that, let that shit come later in life. But you want to build something for yourself. You want to build your confidence. You want to go through things and see how you handle life. You know, you don't want to wait until you get married to see how you handle. Nah, I'm telling you, you think it's easy. These women demand attention, they change. I'm telling you, bro. I'm not telling you like this because I, I heard it from, no, it's real. I experienced this shit, you know? And you can't blame nobody but yourself when the shit go left. Because as a man, you're supposed to have everything in order. Before it happened, you should get things in order, you know? And like I say, in my 20s, I wasn't thinking about order. I wasn't thinking about none of that shit, you know? So some things that happened, it went over my head. Until I hit my 30s, then I start saying, like, damn, that's what I'm supposed to do. You know? So I'm telling you right now, as a man, hold off of marriage. Be patient. You know? Create your life. Get in a relationship with your life first. Get that relationship. Like, I'm telling you, fall in love with being alone. Be okay with being alone. It's, it's so crazy because once you become okay with being alone, that's when women start really coming to your life with ease. You know? Marriage is not for everybody. It's just not. 
It can make you or it can break you. And a lot of men have been broken. I'm talking about broken forever. It's some men who get married, get remarried. Get, you know, nah, you, you don't want to be that guy either. You don't want to go through that. You want to avoid, you want to avoid a lot of setbacks as possible. As much setbacks, you want to avoid them. And marriage is the one. Like I say, you will know if a woman really loves you. You know why? Because she don't need nothing from you. The only thing she gonna need from you is for you to be in your presence. Damn. The only thing she gonna need from you is to be in your presence. That's it. She not gonna ask you about dates. She not gonna ask you about, can you give me? Nah. That's when you know, you know, and even then, you always have to be prepared for the switch up. Always be prepared, you know. Always be prepared for the switch up. Because anything is possible, man. You know, anything is possible. And I'm going to leave on that.